extra GMT. Now, what do you think of that? I've got two GMTs. Is that nonsense? If you <laughs> have the money, no. And I, I get why you did what you did. And uh, So I've got one to hoard, one to collect, yeah. one to... One to wear. Right, and one to wear. And, and, and I don't... What's wrong with that? Yeah, and so I still get to in, enjoy the GMT experience, but I don't have any of the stress of that A serial getting any nicks on it. It makes no sense, but it makes perfect sense. Do you wear it at all, like in the house, or? No, no, no never. No, I just look at it. I just wind <laughs> it. I, I, I wind it once a month, and and that's it. And I look at it, and uh, you know, when I wouldn't enjoy a GMT, well, I've got the P serial to do that with. Yeah. So it sits, it sits in a bank safe. And I pop by, and you know, I, I I might get out the sub, or I might, you know, but I, I wind it once a month. I look at it, I visit it, and um, and <laughs> it's it's amazing because I actually get enjoyment out of it. A lot of people write in and say, you know, this is sad what you're doing. I feel sorry for you. No, I don't think so. But I actually get enjoyment knowing that there's a a perfect piece uh, in my possession, even though I can't see it. You know. Just knowing it's sitting in a box gives me gives me like you know great pleasure. Well, I mean, I have a watch that belonged to my grandfather. It's not worth anything, but it has sentimental value. Excuse me, <coughs> sentimental value. He's getting checked out. Uh, <laughs> a little bit of a cold, I think, coming on. <coughs> but it's not something I can wear a lot because it could be damaged. Yeah. But once a week, pull out of the box, and I wind it, mm -hmm. you know, and I look at it, and I remember my grandfather. I put it back. I want to make sure that it doesn't get all dried up in there. You got to keep it moving, but it's the same kind of feeling that you you get. There's mm -hmm. just a bit of satisfaction and enjoyment out of it. So I, I can totally get that. Yeah, I mean, it's it's, it's how you look at the watch. Do you do you look at it as like do you enjoy it for its perfection? And if so, uh, then then wearing it detracts from that type of enjoyment. It's just like you know people who collect cars. I mean, if you have a really old old vintage Porsche. Um, and it's sitting in a garage, right? I'm, I'm sure that Jay Leno has has cars he doesn't drive because yeah. he just gets more enjoyment looking at them, and and he doesn't want to he doesn't want to you know the, is there is there perfection? Whereas, uh, you know, a, 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 he 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 might get an extra car just to tool around in and, and have the experience. So that's the that's well. As someone who owns a classic Mercedes, I own a 1985 500 SEC. It's got about about a hundred. 506,000 miles on it. Mm -hmm. If it was a, a virgin, you know, a garage queen or it had 50 or 60,000 miles, I'd be afraid to drive it. Yeah. But mine is nice enough that it looks great, but it's flawed enough that I can drive it. Mm -hmm. And I get enjoyment out of it. Uh, I don't want one that will sit in the garage and I can only look at it. Mm -hmm. uh, I do want something I can use. But were I to buy another Mercedes, I would want something more of a garage queen that I would drive like once a month. All right, there you go. Okay, so I have the one that I can drive. Eventually, I'll want the one that I drive rarely. Yeah, so you can you can enjoy cars and watches in, in two different ways, and that's tough for, I think, some people to get their head around because yeah. they think, you know, you got to feel the steel. I'm not calling up Mark there, but, but he <laughs> likes to use his watches. I don't think he's a hoarder, but other people I don't uh, uh, think and understand that. Uh, you can look at these things as uh, uh, pieces of uh, perfection, uh, pieces more like of pieces of art in a way, and, and in that sense, uh, you don't have to use it to have fun with it.